On June 18th, 2024, a seemingly ordinary 1982p Roosevelt dime fetched an astonishing $480 at auction. What made this dime so special? It was an uncirculated superb gem boasting full bands or full torch definition on the reverse side. Full bands refers to the crisp, distinct horizontal lines on the torch design, which is a key feature collectors seek. This particular dime, graded Mint State 67FB by PCGS, showcases these bands in pristine detail. According to PCGS, only 12 dimes have earned this coveted grade, with none rated higher. This rarity and exceptional quality propelled its value to an impressive $480. If you enjoyed this numismatic gem, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating coin stories and updates. Your support helps us bring you the best in coin collecting news. Step into the world of numismatic rarities with this intriguing wartime error coin. Behold, the 1944p Jefferson Nickel struck on a bronze scent planchette, a true marvel of minting mishap. Graded AU58 by PCGS, this circulated five cent piece carries a tale as unique as its composition. During the tumult of 1944, the U.S. Mint, in its wartime fervor, utilized a blend of 56% copper, 35% silver, and 9% manganese for nickel production. However, fate had other plans for a handful of planchettes originally destined for 1943 cents. These stray planchettes found themselves under 1944 nickel dyes, resulting in a small but extraordinary run of 1944 nickels struck on bronze planchettes. Coveted by collectors for their scarcity and historical peculiarity, these error coins are a testament to, to the unpredictability of minting. The 1944p Jefferson Nickel on a bronze planchette is particularly prized, especially when found in superior condition like this AU58 specimen. Recently, this elusive error nickel found its way into the limelight at Stax Bowers auction, commanding a staggering price of over $3,000. A testament to its allure and rarity, this coin stands as a captivating piece of numismatic history, inviting collectors to ponder the mysteries of minting errors. How does this revised version resonate with you? The 2000p Sacagawea dollar variety, known affectionately as the Cheerios dollar, is a coveted gem among collectors. Graded a remarkable Mint State 68 by PCGS, this coin shines as a true standout in the numismatic realm. But wait, there's more to this story. This unique offering also includes the 2000p Lincoln Cheerio scent, adding another layer of intrigue to this numismatic pairing. Each coin is individually graded and encapsulated by PCGS, showcasing the Cheerios dollar at MS68 and the Cheerios scent at MS66RD. What makes the Cheerios dollar so special? Back in 2000, General Mills partnered with the U.S. Mint to promote the new Sacagawea dollar. They distributed a limited number of these coins in boxes of Cheerios cereal, each accompanied by a 2000 Lincoln cent. These promotional coins are distinguishable by the pronounced enhancement to the detail of the eagle's tail feathers. Despite their initial distribution, only 5,500 examples of this variety made their way into the hands of collectors and enthusiasts. Many of these Cheerios dollars were spent or mishandled by non-numismatists, making them even scarcer today. This extraordinary lot recently commanded a price of $6,600 at a Stax Bowers auction, a testament to the allure and rarity of these coins. Don't miss your chance to own a piece of numismatic history with the Cheerios dollar and its accompanying scent, a delightful duo that captures the spirit of coin collecting. To the untrained eye, this quarter may appear tarnished, but it's actually a toned and uncirculated Washington quarter, highly sought after for its preservation level and eye-catching appearance. The 1949D Washington quarter features olive green, amber, and russet hues around the collar, graded mint state 67 plus by PCGS. During an economic recession, the Denver Mint's production of quarter dollars dropped significantly in 1949. While this issue is not rare in Mint State, the certified population thins considerably above MS-66. Unlike their Philadelphia counterparts, 1949D quarters, while well-made, seem to be more prone to contact marks. This particular toned 1949D quarter dollar was auctioned for $600 on June 18, 2024 at Heritage Auctions. Here is another highly valued error coin. 
1964 Lincoln cent struck 25% off center. Graded mint state 64 red and brown by PCGS, this coin exemplifies an off center strike, which occurs when the planchette is not properly aligned with the dies during minting. This misalignment results in a portion of the design being missing, leading to an incomplete impression on the coin. In this instance, about 25% of the Lincoln cent is off center, with the design shifted towards the west. Such errors are popular among collectors due to their uniqueness and the insight they provide into the minting process. The value of this error coin can vary based on its condition and the degree of the off-center strike. This particular cent was sold for $228 on June 17, 2024 at Heritage Auctions. This 1967 Washington Quarter graded Mint State 68 stands out as an exceptional high-end gem. The U.S. Mint struck over 1.5 billion 1967 Washington Quarters for circulation, making them very common in most grades. Examples up to about MS-66 are very easy to find, while those in MS-67 are much scarcer. This remarkable coin was sold for over $1,100 on June 16, 2024. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. Your support helps us create better videos and keeps you updated with the latest. Thank you. An incredible error coin. This is a 1976 D Eisenhower dollar with reverse mirror brockage and 5% off center strike, graded mint state 62 by NGC. A brockage occurs when a previously struck coin gets jammed between the dies, resulting in a second reversed impression on the next coin. On this piece, the devices on each side are only 5% off-center, with just the tops of the letters of Liberty missing. The brockage side is well-defined, and most of the struck side is too, except for the dates. This type is rare with a brockage, and it appears to be the first we have offered. Its rarity is further enhanced by the bicentennial type. The surfaces are brilliant, with a number of small, wispy abrasions accounting for the grade. It was sold for over $13,000. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the most highly sought-after error coins in U.S. coinage, presenting the 1917 Lincoln cent with a double die obverse. Graded mint state 67 plus red by PCGS, this coin is an essentially pristine example of this coveted variety. Soft pastels of powder blue and pink frame the tangerine color at the centers of each side. The well-struck devices are complemented by smooth, matte-like fields blanketed with satiny luster, making it beautiful to examine in hand and technically exceptional. The 1917 FS101 is one of the most pronounced double-die obverse varieties in the entire Lincoln Scent series, featuring sharp doubling on the digits and the date and the letters God We Trust in the motto. In the 2009 edition of the Cherry Picker's Guide to Rare Die Varieties of United States Coins, Bill Fivaz and J.T. Stanton described the 1917 FS101 DDO as arguably the most sought after of the early Lincoln scent varieties. This scent sold for an impressive $120,000 at Stax Bowers Auction.